So today we are in Budapest. And right now we're gonna check out the St. Stephen's Basilica, which is beautiful and the architecture in Hungary is unbelievable. So I'm excited to see what uh, beauty we get to capture today. Yesterday we walked this area. I mean, it took us, it's probably like three miles long walking this whole area. Not this whole area, but you know, it's a whole shopping district. And we drove here from Belgrade, Serbia. It only took us about three and a half hours. And it was just like a straight shot down the highway to get here, which is uh, pretty awesome that we can come here for long weekends. And it's like a whole other world. Very European and tourists everywhere because Budapest has become like such a tourist attraction. I mean, there's so much to do and see and eat. I mean, there's every single kind of restaurant that you can imagine to eat at. So it's a pretty good idea to get an Airbnb or a hotel in this area. Everything's pretty much in walking distance, um, which is great. And a little pro tip, make sure you wear inserts in your shoes and band-aids on your feet if you want to prevent from having blisters and aches, which are inevitable to have. So now we're heading from the, what are we, pest side of Budapest and going to the Buddha side, where we're gonna cross the famous chain bridge. Tonight, we're going on a boat cruise where we're gonna see the entire city lit up from the water. I'm so excited about that. So we're going to travel to the top up there to get a view of the whole city, but check out check out this line that we have to wait to take the funicular up. We could walk up there, but we're feeling a little lazy. But check out this line. Yeah. I think we're gonna walk. Get some exercise. Burn those calories. Oh wait, we already got a view already. Just from those short steps. I'm glad we didn't decide to wait in that line. We would have just been standing there for probably 30 minutes when all you really had to do is walk this. And it ain't no thing. This is incredible. It's totally worth our uh, five minute hike. Have you tried the Hungarian beer yet? Uh, yeah, three different times. What do you think of it? It's okay. I've had, had better, but <laughs> I haven't tried them all yet. See, Dominic's a beer connoisseur. He's English, so he better be. <laughs> 77 degrees, according to Apple. Oh, it's only 77 degrees? Way hotter than that. Only 77 degrees, and I'm over here sweating. However, look what I'm wearing. I didn't dress for the occasion. Yeah, black, black under there. Black on black. It's slimming, okay? My photog, my Instagram husband. I'm not on Instagram. Yeah, but you take all my Instagram pictures, so that makes you an Instagram husband. I just can't seem to get over how cute these streets are. They're so colorful. It's almost like on every corner there's a cafe, full of people, having drinks, having espresso. And then you turn around and you get views like that. We sat for some refreshments at Jamie Oliver's bar. And now we're figuring out our next move. Um, we're pretty spontaneous and go with the flow when we go on our travels, but we like to do kind of a loose itinerary. So I made a list of all the things that were recommended. Um, to see and where to eat, and so right now, Dominic's checking out the map. 
and we're going to head towards, um, we still have to see Budapest Castle and um, the thermal baths, but we're going to the thermal baths tomorrow. So Dominic and I were looking for this restaurant that has a panoramic view of the whole city, and it was right here in front of us the entire time. Shoot. Maybe we can still get a view. Oh my god. The view. So we found the perfect view. We were able to get it. Are you ready for this? Good morning, we are at the Sicini Thermal Baths in Budapest. And last night uh, we went for a cocktail cruise on the Danube and we saw the all of the city lights lit up. We got to see Parliament lit up. It was pretty awesome. Um, I highly recommend that. You got, we got two free cocktails with it where you could get beer and wine. And we don't recommend the cocktails because they were a little, uh, or a lot watered down to go for beer or wine and then um, after that we decided to be a little spontaneous and go check out the ruined pubs um, I don't remember the name of the particular one we went to but I'll put it right here on the screen anyways it was awesome it was super um, eccentric decor and really fun music and there was multiple uh, bars inside the place and uh, yeah I highly recommend going there and there's several through Budapest so we had a really good time so um, surprisingly we're not feeling um, hungover <laughs> and uh, even if we were today would be the perfect day to just relax by the pool and the warm water and enjoy a spa day together we went in one pool and it's feels lukewarm and then the other one feels like a hot tub. Oh my gosh, it's perfect for sore muscles when you're walking around sightseeing the day before. And now uh, we've just been chilling, relaxing. It's been a perfect day. 